Well, it's only, hey, that's good. Man, y'all look good. Y'all look real good today. It's only appropriate that uh, we would dedicate a baby on Mother's Day. How about that for timing? And the Andersons are going to bring, and he's already smiling. <laughs> yeah, bring Liam up here, would y'all? And uh, here's what happens. This is, uh, this is a matter of stewardship. When, when God gives us something good, the right thing is, is to give it back to God. And that's what the Andersons are going to do today with uh, little, little Liam. And this is, if you haven't figured this out, the guy smiling the biggest is Grandpa over there. He is our children's pastor, Pastor Jeremy, and, and his uh, wife. And there's Uncle, Uncle Jabe. Boy, are you happy? If you're happy and you know it, say amen. <laughs> Freezes up in the front of the mic. Well, Alex and Estella, God has blessed you. So I, that, is, that is obvious. I don't need to preach that sermon to you. But it's, uh, it's been your desire that uh, when God gifted you with this baby that you'd bring him to the altar and give him back to the Lord. We base this on, uh, on the, 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 the gospel of Matthew where little children were brought to Jesus for him to place his hands on them and to pray for them. But the disciples re rebuked him. Jesus said, wait a minute. <laughs> Let the little children, let the little children come to me. And do not hinder them, for the kingdom of heaven belongs to such as these. Alex and Estella, in presenting Liam for dedication today, you signify not only your faith in the Christian religion, but also your desire that he may early know and follow the will of God and may live and die a Christian and come unto everlasting blessedness. In order to attain this holy end, it will be your duty as his parents, to teach him early the fear of the Lord, to watch over his education that he be not led astray, to direct his youthful mind to the Holy Scriptures and his feet to the sanctuary, and to restrain him from evil associates and habits, and as much as in you lies to bring him up in the nurture and the admonition of the Lord. If this is what you intend to do, and you'll endeavor to do it with the help of God, if so, answer, we will. <laughs> You're for it too, aren't you, buddy? You think you'd let me show him off? All right. Hold that, Papa. Let me, let me see. We, we drink coffee together. <laughs> we drink coffee. He before. drinks the most. He does. <laughs> Father God, what an awesome moment we stand here to do when we dedicate Liam to you. Lord, uh, it's our desire that uh, us as a church and as a family, Lord, that through Liam's uh, formidable years, through his childhood and into his teens, that we will set an example of what Christ looks like. Lord, that when this world tries to teach him different, that all he has to do is look towards his family and towards this church to show him what truth looks like. Lord, we are so thankful. So thankful for your great mercy, your great love for us, that we can stand here and do this. And Lord, we just pray that he will grow up to know 
that mercy, that grace. We love you. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so remember the day. Here's a, a rose. Usually the, the children's pastor does this, but since Grandpa uh, is doing that, and here's a certificate of the day, and hopefully his, his first Bible. <laughs> Let's congratulate him. Good job. <laughs> <laughs>